It's the show that teaches you Japanese while traveling. Meet and speak. This time, our trio will be experiencing the history of Shimoda, which lies in the southernmost part of the Izu Peninsula. Shimoda, Gateway to Japan. The trio took a train from Ito Station. From there, it took about one hour to get to Shimoda at the southern tip of Izu. This is the first place in Japan to open itself to people from abroad. This is a really nice place. Oh wow, yeah. really excited. Yeah, that's nice. So this map. Let's go. Yeah, okay. let's go. Shimoda, where the trio have come, is full of beautiful white sandy beaches. Many foreigners living in Japan come here to sightsee and stay at the many beach resorts. Shimoda is a flourishing port town, and lots of fish are landed here. As the first port of Japan opened to the west, Shimoda is home to many historic streets. The coastal landscapes are another highlight. Wow, wow, look at the trees, they're different. So yeah, pretty. that's true. Are they what ropeway, this Hi, so this. This is similar to the one in Atami. Let's go on it. What do you want to say in Japanese? Let's go. 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 First, they are taking a cable car up to an observatory to see all of Shimoda. Are we early? Hello, Ai. Let's learn some more Japanese together today. Hello, Ai. Let's learn some more Japanese together today. Today, let's start with some hiragana. Let's try to read some new characters with Weo san. Cha, chu, cho, hya, hyu, cho. Next come numbers. Let's study today. We are going to study how to count minutes. Five minutes in Japanese is gofun. Let's practice. Gofun. Ju gofun. Yon ju gofun. Ten minutes is jupun. Let's practice. Jupun. Our three friends arrive at the cable car ticket counter. Kathy checks the timetable with the Japanese she's learned. Amy, You can read the time in Japanese now. Yeah. Yes. They check the timetable, buy their tickets, and board the cable car to the top. Look at that. So oh, wow. Look wow. This oh, the mountains are beautiful. It's really pretty. In three and a half minutes, they've reached the top. Oh, wow. Look at that wow. Oh, it feels so good. That's so good. nice. Oh, it's beautiful. See what Nihongo de Nanto imasuka? Umi to imasu. Umi. Kirei na umi desu ne. あれは何ですか？あれは黒船です。黒船？What does that mean? Japanese。Why is it famous? It's deeply related to Shimoda history, but you will find out later. Before that, it's study time. Now I'm going to introduce the names of some countries. Note that although we've written country names in hiragana, they're usually written with a different set of Japanese characters called katakana or kanji. This is a rule for making words about nationality. Take the country's name and add jin. Now you have their nationality. So for America, America, 
アメリカ人。人means person in Japanese. Let's practice. 中国人。アメリカ人。イギリス人。韓国人 And this is the rule for making words about languages. Korean language is. 韓国語 Chinese language is. 中国語 And English? 英語 Ago is an exception. Yeah, there's so many boats around here. It's it beautiful, is. isn't it? It is beautiful. It's just it out hey, I wonder what that is. This Perry. He's a very famous American American. This is a bronze statue of American naval officer Matthew Calbreth Perry. He led an armada that landed in Japan during the mid 19th century and established the relationship between the U.S. and Japan. The darkly colored battleships Perry led to Japan were called black ships. Today, over 150 years later, reproductions of these ships embark on pleasure cruises, and there is also a black ship festival. They are on Perry Road, where Perry walked along when he signed the Treaty of Amity and Commerce between Japan and the United States. Look at them, look at them, they mean like something. Hello! Hey, baby. Hi! Hey, baby. You're a good boy, hey, huh? How cute. Konnichiwa! Taking a break and eating some sweets. By the way, Cedric, you're from France, right? Mm-hmm. France, wa Nihongo de Nanto Yimasuka? France, to Yimas. Ja, Cedric san wa France jin desu ne? Mm, so desu ne. Subarashi desu ne. <laughs> There's a statue over there. <laughs> Go about 500 meters further, and Perry Road ends here. Rio Senji Temple, a national historical landmark. Here, Perry signed the treaty, marking the beginning of Japan's opening up to the world. The three make a stop at the Rio Senji Treasure Museum. The museum has over 3,000 items relating to the black ships and Japan's opening up to the world. You can see the many years of history since Perry and his fleet came to Japan. It must have been so, such a like, exciting. exciting time. It must be, yeah. It's great that it's written in both Japanese and English.、Mm, that's true. It's very Studying easy. Japanese in Shimoda, where Japan opened up to the world. Now let's review today's lesson. Today we studied how to count minutes. これは5分です。これは40分です。We also learned the rules for making words for a person's nationality and words for languages. これは誰ですかペリーです。とても有名なアメリカ人です。That's all for today's lesson. さようなら。It's called like that because there is a lot of himono all over all along the road, the settings.、Oh. Yeah. Sorry, what is this? Sanma. 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 Sanma.